Okay, so many people, I have my reflection, have been asking me to play this character. I don't really know why, but sure, I'll do it. Apparently they have a secret ending, which sounds sick, so I'm going for it. This character starts with a soul heart, a black heart, and a bone heart. This is Tainted Samael. They also have a, just a non-tainted version, but people ask me to play this version. Uh, and that's a cool rotten heart. So they can get red hearts despite starting with only uh, black and soul hearts. And I also have a pocket active, which looks like uh, a clock. It's called Memento Mori. I don't know what this does. What? Huh? Is it like... Tainted Judas? Hello? Oh my, uh, that's sick. Hold on. What? That's actually awesome. Okay, that's sick. Is there like a limit on how much I can do that? Because that seems kind of, kind of good. Also, his scythe is just strong. I mean, I understand that I started with a damage up as well, but this just feels like a good character. So for the secret ending, I don't know much, but what I do know is I have to go to the cathedral route, destroy Isaac, and then destroy Blue Baby. And then apparently the rest is self-explanatory, basically. So I'm not going to spoil it. We're just going to try for it. Uh, I don't really know how I should be using Memento Mori here. It seems like it's kind of hard to use. Oh my god, my brain. It's not exactly like Tainted Judas though, because Judas is completely intangible when he does his move. Whereas like this, it seems like I can actually get hit while trying to set it up. So I have to be careful. And I imagine it works like, uh, you know, more damage equals more damage, more tears equals fire, uh, or fire. Higher fire rate. I guess I swing my sword faster, my scythe. It looks like I just have Death Scythe, like I'm just holding it. Was that a unique falling animation, by the way? That looked like really cool. <laughs> okay, how about we don't go in there. We did pick up a planet, Terium Chance, uh, which is cool. Verp the Verp, very epic, thank you. Okay, nice, appreciate that. Why do I have a Polaroid? That's, that must be something unique to the character, right? Because I'm pretty sure I don't have a Polaroid. That was Polaroid invincibility. Lemonade, I don't really need. I'll take a blind. Backstabber. Knowing how broken Backstabber is and everything counts as a backstab. Also, I literally have a knife as an item. I feel like 99% of the time I'm going to whack something, it's going to be a backstab, yeah. Now that we went to the treasure room, I'm kind of tempted to go in that vault room as well as the curse room. And I need to be careful because I don't really have that much help to, you know, give away so willy-nilly. Also, it's my first time playing the character, so I don't want to be uh, too aggressive with my playstyle, you know what I mean? So how about we do something like this? There's also a soul of loss making me kind of want to go to... Devils? Ah, uh, sure. Oh my gosh, there's a goddamn black market. Is there anything cool in here? A deep pocket? Oh my god, there's a steam cell. Gimme. <laughs> just straight up give me that. I just want that. If I can get even more, then I'd love so, but I need to probably blow up my donation machine to do that. Oh my lord, that is so- this character does damage. Let's make sure to use Memento Mori as much as we can, just because it seems like a fun item. Set it up and go. Oh, oh my god, that's cool! Ah, I just realized that I can't take a devil deal. It's pretty good, but I'm not too annoyed at the fact that I missed out on this. I'm actually going to use the hermit here, uh, and I did not get a donation machine. All right. Now it's a low chance, but oh my god, I actually spawned in with so much money. <laughs> I can't believe it. I got more options. That's crazy good. All right, let's go to the next floor. Dude, this character is really fun. So what I'm wondering is, maybe they just have a built-in Polaroid? No, what am I talking about? I just realized I have mysterious paper. That's the reason I had the Polaroid effect. That has to be it, right? It doesn't have a built-in Polaroid. I find myself not even using Memento Mori that much. It just feels good to just- oh! God knows what this does. Probably ruins the entire character. Oh no, I just get a text blade. Oh my god, that looks cool. I am a techno-visor dude. Does this do anything new? I'm, I'm sorry, I... What? <laughs> okay, one, that's a cool synergy. Two, I'm pretty sure Memento Mori is bugged because I just pressed it like a bunch of times in the treasure room and it paid the treasure room sound like a ton of times. But we'll move past that, don't worry about it. Boom. That is so cool, I love this character actually. Shout out to you guys for uh, suggesting me to play this character. I know you guys have been suggesting for a long time. I have so many ideas and suggestions I got to get to. But uh, shout out to the people that stay dedicated in the comments. Just keep asking me. Because eventually, you know, I do read my comments. It's my favorite part of the day. Eventually I get around to it. Old bandage. Talk about a broken item. And then... Oh! oh, he has his own little dance animation. Look at him go. Oh, look at him go. He's so cute. 
That's so cute. I gotta take it, obviously. Oh my god. Does this do anything cool? It sure does. Wow. This character is kind of sick, actually. Anything juicy in here. No curses is 1 billion percent juicy. I'll also take this, even though I don't really have flies, just because it's on sale. It's pretty cheap. We'll go to the mirror dimension, and let's see how powerful this Tech X Brimstone really is. Can I tell you how lucky I am, by the way, to get Tech X Brimstone, same floor, really early on? It's pretty good. Oh my god, it's stupid good. I guess the way you should be playing the character is just swiping and casually pressing Q while doing a room. Just because there's no reason not to, right? It doesn't seem like there's a cooldown on it. It doesn't seem like there's a reason not to do it. So I definitely want to get up close now because my Tech X Brim uh, like ring around me does do uh, consistent damage. I don't know if it scales with my damage. Uh, does this more range? It is more range! I can uh, shoot further. And it looks like my Tech X is kind of bigger. Maybe placebo, but it looks like it to me. Then I think we'll head out. Uh, probably a god floor for me. I'm chilling. <laughs> We're doing great. I'm not gonna go to the caves, or sorry, the mines. I will go to the caves. I'm just gonna chill and see if we can make our way all the way to the cathedral uh, and try and get that secret ending. That is a unique falling animation. That looks so cool. Does the ticks from my Tech X count as backstab? It does. So the, the Tech X Brimstone can also backstab. Little crazy. Now, I don't know about you guys, but for me personally, I never feel like Rust Key does anything. And this is not because it doesn't do anything. It definitely does. Speed down sucks, whatever. Uh, I can't go in there. It's because back in the day in vanilla, Rusted Key was actually bugged and literally did nothing. And whenever I find it in Rebirth, I get PTSD. I feel like it- oh my god! But yeah, back in vanilla, it uh, literally didn't do anything at all. Because a lot of things were bugged in Flash, right? So now whenever I find it, I uh, just have the inclination like, oh, it's not gonna do anything. And I forget that obviously it's gonna do something, it's fixed. It's been fixed for like 10 years! You know, this didn't even need to be a Tainted Samael run. <laughs> I'm gonna say it, <laughs> this could have been a, just a crazy run if any character played, but I sure am happy that it's Tainted Samael playing right now, so we get to see some of the coolest synergies they have. And I always appreciate when a new character has such unique synergies, because it's it's crazy the amount of work that they gotta do to do that. Uh, do I have any ranged options as this character? Or am I just kinda boned? What do I- what do I do here? <laughs> it has to be Memento Mori based, right? Oh, look at that! I do have like some kind of thing. I don't know how to manipulate it though. There you go! Okay, so if I tap and then tap again, I just instantly do it and I can shoot out a shockwave. Go! Got it. Alright, alright, now we learned. We Oh wow, Planetarium. Thanks, uh, 8-Ball. We learned that we truly do have something. This might be the only time on Earth that uh, I take Jupiter. Does it have a synergy? It does! It has a synergy with Memento Mori. So it's actually good that I took it as well. Okay, Rag Mega- Rag Mega died is what I was gonna say. Uh, is there a secret room here? There is not. That means there's one place I, I can probably guess and it's right here. And if it's not, I'll leave. It is... And we got more- Oh, you broke even! Nice! Uh, I'm not gonna blow up those mushrooms because I do actually kind of want some of my bombs. Well, this is an insanely cool character. Okay, cannot forget the goal though. We are locked into Devil Deals, which is nice. We have to go up. Make sure you take the Polaroid. Amnesia, Vine Boom. Have fun figuring out where you are! Doo -doo -doo. Wow, I found the boss immediately. Probably shouldn't do this yet, but uh, whatever. The war fight. These Team T's are kind of scaring me. That guy exploded. I didn't take damage for three floors? Whoa! Hold on. A little bit of a pat on the back for me. Anything in here? The Megaton? You know, these are both actually decent. We'll take this, and then we'll take this, because we know we're going to take Polaroid, so we'll have Polaroid invincibility. And you know what, actually? Boom. Oh, yeah. I was kind of hoping for a double deal item. Anything juicy in here? Uh, comp ass for a little bit of mapping, I'll take. I've been getting Brimstone a lot recently. I've been going to Devils a lot more than Angels, which in my opinion is just worse. I don't think it's bad, I just think the Angels are better in general. But Devils have been rewarding me, man. I feel good. Homing. This has to do something with this character, right? I mean, it's definitely purple, so it looks cool. Oh uh, yeah, the Tech X Brim is homing and probably the Cricket's uh, body shots that are coming out as well. In fact, don't I shoot out a brim when I do this? This is pro- WHOA! 
Look at that. I want to know what this does. Pop open. Oh my god, this character is cool. Nah, this character is kind of busted actually. Holy. This character is not fair. Look at this. This is crazy good. Let me find my secret room. Lose, uh, lose the Megaton. Use the Megaton. And we'll head out. I still have not been hit, by the way. I don't think I'm going to keep um, my perfection throughout everything, but I'll try my best. Alright, I'll give it one more guess. I think it could be here. Nice. Oh my god! How did I get Birthright? I got it from the La Megaton? What does this spin down into? Flip, we don't need that. I. This is a crazy run. This is just crazy. I don't- I, This is- What? Uh, I gotta look up what the Birthright does. Uh, I'll head to the next floor and figure it out. Or actually, you know what? It's probably obvious if I just uh, walk around enough. How about I just try and figure it out myself? It's probably something to do with Memento Mori, right? It says unleash their souls when I got it, so does this do anything cool? Not yet. It might do something cool later. What if I actually kill someone? Oh, see? I'm gaining souls, and that did something. <laughs> Ooh, I wonder what. Do I have to use Memento Mori for souls? No, I can just get souls. I don't see my stats changing when I pick up souls. So what is it doing, specifically? What's in the treasure room, by the way? We have more options, so it should be okay. I'll take this for Beelzebub, since I kind of need flight. Or I should have checked the spin downs on that, my bad. I completely forgot that I have spin down, because... Dude, what the hell? Why is there a spin down randomly? If I can't figure out what the wisps are doing, uh, in time, like, probably by the next floor, I'll look it up. But I kind of want to figure it out myself. Oh! Oh, look, 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 look! I figured it out, look. Memento Mori has a counter next to it right now. I... We'll take Mr. Belly. So I imagine I'm buffing up my Memento Mori for something. Uh, I guess it just is more powerful. Because when I use Memento Mori, it went down by two just now. So it must just be getting buffed whenever I do this. I don't even think I need to explore the rest, do I? I'd rather uh, fight Boss Rush. That sounds fun. This is such an insane build, dude. What is going on? Cool. Still have not been hit. Take the Polaroid because we're going up. And then here we have Piercing, which wouldn't do much for me. Fast Bombs and Lacrophagy, which seems like that would be the craziest thing. Unfortunately, there's a Haemolacria, but I can't do anything about that. I can't spin down. So I'm just going to have to... Oh, it says right there, no synergy implemented. Ah, oh, damn, that sucks. I guess the best thing would be Fast Bombs, huh? Or I guess, I guess Cupid's Arrow. A little unfortunate, but that's what I get for not having uh, spin down ready. Oh my god, dude! That's so broken! I crashed! Well, guess what? This gives me an opportunity to get Haemolacria. <laughs> that, or maybe I shouldn't do Boss Rush again, because that is what kind of crashed me, but whatever. I'm just gonna- cut to when I get Haemolacria. I'm gonna go- I'm gonna get it. Boom. Take Hamo. What does this do? Wait, my tier rate is so low, but it really doesn't matter anymore. I really hope I don't crash again. That's insane. Memento Mori is broken. With this, it's done. We're, we're over here. I found the craziest- I I found it. The fact that it's all homing too. Also, I haven't been hit this time, so this time I kept my perfection. I just keep spamming Memento Mori and it's, it's just done for. So it looks like the Memento Mori Wisps go down by one. Uh, I don't need this, but it's fine. Uh, for the counter with Birthright. And I'm assuming just every single time you use Memento Mori with a counter, it just does more damage or something, you know? Now, uh, I will say, what I know is that I have to kill Isaac with my scythe, and then I get the secret ending. Does that entail that if I kill Isaac with the brimstone that's following afterwards, I don't get the secret ending? I don't know. This actually could be true. Uh, if that's the case, I don't know what I'm gonna do, actually. The Fallen. It has fallen. A <laughs> uh, little delirium. Oh, I should have checked the spin down. Oh my god. 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 Are they chucking Haemolac- I can't believe it. I don't know how this is gonna work. Do I have like any AoE? Like if I- uh, even if I shoot a wall, I kill things too fast. Okay, we'll find- we'll figure it out when I get there. For now, let's just enjoy destroying Hush. Boom. Uh, sure, I'll take a Tears Up, why not? And then in here, I will take a, uh, more eyes. Does it actually work? Probably. Oh god. Broken Modem is nice. Uh, and then these are whatever. Oh my god, there's a Joker. I don't have the health for it, but that would have been cool. Okay, 
Let's see. Did I just kill Hush? Uh, it should probably take about two swings. <laughs> Let's set this up real quick, and then boom! Yeah, it, I mean, it's, it's. I think the run's okay. Could be better, I think. Oh my god, he's dead! <laughs> that was so fast! Soul of Samael. Who knows what that does? Probably you guys, because this character's been out for a bit. Not, I just haven't played him. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna see. I'm gonna test. Let's see, if I could just kill Isaac and it counts. I don't know. Well, what I know is from the guide that I saw, I have to specifically kill Isaac with my sight. So I'm kind of nervous. I don't know if it's actually going to work here. All right, big reveal. Can I just kill you? No. Oh, I can. Oh, we're good. Wow, he's dead. Uh, so we're supposed to take this and then go to the chest. I was a little nervous there, but we lucked out. So we go to the chest, and now we have to go and beat Blue Baby. Let's look at all of these. Um, kind of want Libra here. Libra wouldn't be bad, considering how my stats look. We could take this for conjoined, spin it down, actually get conjoined, and then take Libra. And this will probably be a nice tears up for us. Yeah. Okay, that's probably what broke my game. Whoopsies. I'd say that was a good decision by me. Thank you, Libra. Shout out to all the Libra enjoyers. You guys are very base. Another chest. A Zodiac. Cool. And now, all we have to do is destroy Blue Baby, thanks to the Soul Heart. And he should also drop something. Let's see. He gets sliced. Watch out! And he drops face reward. I really want to- I really want to spin it down into Incubus. We're supposed to take this, and then you TP to the Dark Room. And from the Dark Room, now I gotta go kill the Lamb. These are all fine. Uh, that turns into a dead cat, which is broken. So, we should do that. We'll take the habit just cuz, and then we'll take this, and we'll move on. Overall thoughts on the character? He's broken. Yeah, I'm just gonna say it. He's just straight up broken. I know I got lucky though. I'm not gonna like be like, oh no, nah, he's just broken in general. I got I got so insanely lucky. I got Tech X Brimstone on the same floor, then got what? Cricket's body, Hamo, Twisted Pear, Spoonbender. Like I any character would be broken if, if they had this pill. Now from here on out, I really don't know what's supposed to happen. I know I'm just supposed to kill the lamb. And something happens and I'm supposed to get a secret ending. So if the ending starts playing, I'm going to be quiet and let you guys watch through it. And we'll see what happens. So kill the lamb and he gets sliced probably like the other ones. Yeah. And then what? What? It's the forgotten. It's Satan. Satan fight? Oh, <laughs> it's just a Satan fight. Okay, sick. I can do this. Believe it or not, this will be easy for my build. There is a third phase. Done. Anything more? Angels? What? Okay, bye angels. What, I gotta fight like Delirium now? Oh, oh, is this the- I'll be quiet. The music cut out. Oh my god. Oh! It's not over, sorry. Uh, wow, I, that was... Creepy. Remembrance of Death! I unlocked it! I don't know what that is! GG!